Dreamliner jet became a nightmare for LAX passengers trying to get to Denmark. And problems with a Norwegian Airlines flight has dozens of them still waiting to take off. That's right. CBS 2's Randy Page is live at the airport on a day that's usually smooth sailing, Randy. It usually is. You know, people who choose to fly home from Thanksgiving today on Friday usually make a wise decision as they did today. Things have been very smooth with a couple of exceptions. On this day after Thanksgiving, so it's crowds are light, and domestic passengers we spoke to report it's been smooth sailing. Any delays, any problems? No, no, no. Everything's great. Not so great for some of the international travelers. This family from Birmingham, England, just learned their airline, Lufthansa, is on strike. So they're scrambling to catch an American Airlines flight to London. But then we've got to get from London back home. So far, they've been delayed two hours. Could be worse. Huh? Oh, could be worse, yeah. Like two days instead of two hours. We are very tired, very irate. The Norwegian Airlines passenger who shot this cell phone video tells us he gave up after being delayed since Wednesday. This is awful and this is irresponsible. Machi Flees says his flight to Copenhagen returned to the gate twice but left the passengers on the plane without air conditioning for three hours. He says passengers were told to get off the Boeing 787 due to a technical problem, and then at midnight, they were told to go back on the plane to retrieve their belongings in the pitch dark. This is unacceptable for anyone. Fleece told us he gave up, went home to Northridge, and canceled his trip altogether. We were going to a wedding, six months in the planning. Norwegian Airlines provided us with a written statement which says in part, Norwegian apologizes for this extremely unfortunate situation and for all the burden it has caused our customers. This heavy delay was caused by a series of unforeseen and separate incidents, including a medical emergency on board. Our customer service department have so far rebooked 210 affected passengers on either side, on, on either other Norwegian flights or with other airlines. We currently have 53 remaining passengers scheduled to depart tomorrow. And speaking of tomorrow, with rain expected and LAX expecting far more passengers coming here to LAX Saturday and Sunday, be sure to allow extra time if you're coming to pick people up and bring your patients with you. Back to you.